Hey everyone, welcome to another video from Melbourne Gardener. Uh, today I just wanted to share with you how I've been going with uh, my new uh, chicken feed. So I used to use Wagner's own farm mix. It's a 25 kilo bag. Um, I think I get it for about $28. And uh, I have switched to extra egg 17. It's a 20 kilo bag. And I get it for $22 from uh, Dandenong, uh, yeah, uh, I can't remember what the what the place is called. I think it's a Dandenong um, poultry feed uh, store. Um, but anyway, um, so so what's been what's been the result? Uh, I think number one is I did a direct switch. So one day I, I switched from this to that. Um, to be honest, uh, it's been, uh, I, I don't think my, my chickens are really enjoying this feed. Uh, they're not very excited. Um, and I did have a little bit of leftover of the Wagners and they were so keen. Um, and I think, you know, over, <coughs> uh, the realization is that, um, chickens get used to the feed that they, that you give them, um, I um, am realizing that what I need to do is I need to give them extra time on this feed and really try to reduce in, uh, introducing um, some of the leftovers of this feed to them. Otherwise, they will just hold out. So they have not really been eating as much as they normally do. Um, and they have not been laying as much as they normally do, largely because I think they're just transitioning to this new feed and I need to get them really used to it. And I shouldn't introduce the old feed, otherwise they will, uh, yeah, just hold out. They'll think that um, <clears throat> there's more of the old feed to come. Um, so that was my mistake. I introduced this new feed and then I, I, I then... Um, after a week or so, gave them some of the leftovers and they're like really, uh, really uh, interested in that again and then stopped eating. So they've been back and forth. Um, so tip number one is <clears throat> if you are going to switch, just switch completely and you'll have less of a um, down period. Uh, number two is if you mix feeds, uh, they will be picky. They will uh, probably eat the things that... Um, uh, probably are the tastiest to them. It's kind of like uh, giving your children uh, like a mix of ice cream and broccoli. They'll probably uh, focus more on the ice cream than the broccoli. So um, what I found with <coughs> Wagner's isn't that it wasn't um, useful or, you know, uh, uh, um, cost effective, etc. It was just that um, they uh, because it's a mix of mash and there's like, you know, lots of different things in there. It became, um, they became quite picky of what they wanted to eat from the mash. And so what they would do is they would use their beak to scrape out uh, some of the, and, and because it's quite dusty, and um, that therefore uh, you get a, I got a lot of, I got a lot of um, waste. And the waste would drop to the ground and uh, there would be a little mouse that would come all the time to try and um, eat all the waste. So I decided that um, I wanted to switch the pellets because um, one is I heard good things about this one, uh, and two is with pellets, well, it's all the same. So hopefully they will just eat it and there won't be as much um, pickiness. So that's my journey. Um, it's it's probably uh, week two to three for me, uh, and I will uh, make sure I show you what's um, what's uh, what's the progression like. Hopefully, this is useful uh, to you. Um, and you know, let me know what chicken feed you're using. You know whether it's been super successful or not. Um, and yeah, let's continue to share. Thanks. Uh, see you in the next video.